welcome back to my channel. Today I will be teaching you guys how to get this look right over here. If you guys want to see how I did it, go ahead and keep watching. But as always, before we get into the tutorial, go ahead and like the video. Um, comment down below any suggestions for my next video. It'll be up on Wednesday, so I'm going to be reading everything before that. And if you guys want to see more of this little thing over here, go ahead and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Have a great one now. Bye. Okay, so the first step on doing this makeup look is to basically prime your lids. I already primed mine with the Wet n Wild um, eyeshadow base and now we are going in with the MAC 266 and with the chocolate bar tried and true. We are going to be doing this little shade right here it's more peachy than the the other colors on here and this one will just go all over the crease all right and then we are mixing that shade with summer fling from makeup geek which is a blush and just right on top of it Okay, so the next step is to basically go back to the chocolate bar, and then we are using this gold shade right over here. And this one will go all over the lid. Right, And then to get that peachy tone back to it, we are going to be using the Makeup Geek blush again, which is Romance, which is a little bit shimmery than the um, Summer Fling. And that will just go right on top of the gold shade. As so. And then to bring in the darkness on the outer crease, we are going to go back again with the chocolate bar and get this chocolate shade right here, which is the third one from the left. And this one will just go on the outer corner. that and then going back with the MAC 266 just blend it out all right now that everything is blended we are just going to be lining the eye and again you can do a cat eye or you can do a really thin line it's up to you really it's by preference I do like a cat eye that's just my preference and it works with my eyes so that's what I'm gonna be doing and I will be using the Bobbi Brown gel liner in black ink Okay, so after you've lined your eyes, we are going to be cleaning the bottom with the corrector. I am using the Bobbi Brown corrector in Peach Bisque. And with a concealer brush, you are just going to go ahead and do it under the eyes. Alright, and then just blend it with your ring finger. And then we are going to do the foundation right after that. Today I will be using Estee Lauder's Double Wear in Shell Beige. And same brush as last time, the Real Techniques Buffing Brush. Just dot that everywhere, and then you're going to buff it right after. Alright, so after we do the foundation, we are going to be doing concealer, and today I will be using the Makeup Forever HD Concealer. I'll put the shade down below, um, I don't remember, but with the back of my hand, I'm just going to use it as a little palette as always, and this will just go under the eyes, and you can extend it out to your temples also. So after you applied your concealer, we are just going to set the whole thing with powder. Today I will be using the Cargo HD powder in shade 30. We are just going to apply this everywhere. Alright. So, while I was putting on the powder, I decided to do a little bit of baking. So today I will be using the Shade and Light Contour Palette from Kat Von D. And using that yellow shade right there, clearly I use it a lot. We are just going to put this under the eyes. Okay. 
Okay, so after this, I'll go ahead and do um, my bronzer and then my brows, so I will be right back. Okay, a little quick change right over here, but I already um, baked and cooked under the eyes. I did my contour, kind of like the other video that I just did. I did my lashes too and my brows, and the products that I used will be down here. Well, okay, the lashes, I got them from this store in San Diego that sells them for like a dollar, because, you know broke life but yeah they look really nice let's do blush for today I will be using my eco tools brush as always and I will be using peach twist by Mac and sun bask from Mac I'm just gonna mix both of them all right so after the blush is done we are going to be doing the lips and for the lips I kind of mixed a few colors but before this tutorial, I will be mixing probably two or three. We'll see. Alright, so I will be using Candy Yum Yum from MAC. Um, let's do Costa Chic. And then one more. I think it's called Margarita. I think it's from MAC. No idea. It'll be down there. Okay, so this one will just go all over the lips. And then I will be just adding the lip gloss from Lorac, and just a nice pink one. Alright, let's do a little bit of highlighting. I will be using the Bobbi Brown Bronze Glow, this one right here that everyone loved. And I will be using the Smashbox Fan Brush, and this will go all over my cheekbones. Alright, so I decided to put a little bit of red brick from MAC just on the lower lash line and then we will blend it out. And this will give you a little bit more of a pop because, you know, the lips is just not enough yet. Alright guys, so that is the finished look. So, if you guys liked the video, go ahead and like it. Comment down below any suggestions for my next video. And if you guys want to see more of this little thing over here, go ahead and click subscribe. Alright, I will see you guys in my next video. Have a great one now. Bye.